It's been a wild week in the world of AI and if you're into tech, you're going to want to stay tuned because some major players just made a big moves. We're talking about two huge updates from Nvidia and Google that you need to know about. So let's dive right in. First up, Nvidia, the company behind most of the AI systems running on their GPUs, just dropped a huge surprise. They quietly released a new AI model and when I say quietly, I mean no big flashy event, just a low-key release. But here's the catch. This model outperforms GPT-4 in a big way. The new model is called Lama 3.1 Neutron 70B Instruct. Yeah, it's a bit of a mouthful but don't let the name fool you. This thing is a powerful. It's available on Hugging Face now and it's blowing everyone away with its benchmark results. On the Arena Hard Test, it scored an impressive 85.0 which is seriously high. Then, on the Alphaca Evil 2 LC Test, it scored 57.6 and for the GPT-4 Turbo MT benchmark, it got an impressive 8.98. To give you some perspective, these numbers far surpass what OpenAI's GPT-4 and even Antrophic's latest model, Claude 3.5 Sonnet, have achieved. NVIDIA isn't just catching up, they're taking the lead in a big way. What really sets this new model apart is its focus on something called alignment. In AI, alignment refers to how well a model's responses meet the needs and preferences of the user. This is a game changer for businesses because it means fewer mistakes, more relevant answers, and ultimately, better customer satisfaction. NVIDIA has really nailed this concept, making the model better at understanding and responding to user intent instead of generating generic or inaccurate answers. In the long run, this could save companies time and money by reducing the need for constant corrections or oversight, making operations more efficient. NVIDIA has been primarily known for its hardware, especially GPUs, which power many of the AI models we talk about. But now, with this new AI model, they're stepping directly into the language model space. This is a huge shift because it puts NVIDIA in direct competition with software giants like OpenAI, which has dominated the large language model arena. So how did NVIDIA pull this off? They took Meta's open source Llama 3.1 model and enhanced it using advanced techniques like reinforcement learning from human feedback or RLHF. This approach has significantly improved the model's performance and usability. Essentially, NVIDIA is teaching the AI to learn from human preferences, making its responses feel more natural and honestly smarter. This model can handle complex queries without needing you to over-explain or add extra tokens. For example, if you ask a simple question like how many R's in strawberry, the model not only gives you the answer but also explains it. That's a whole new level of intelligence. So, what does this mean for businesses? NVIDIA is making this model available on their platform, build.nvidia.com. They're offering free hosted interference through an API that's compatible with OpenAI. If you're a company considering AI solutions, you are now a serious alternative to GPT-4. NVIDIA's offering might even save you money since it could be more cost-efficient. But that's not all. NVIDIA's model is incredibly flexible, which is a game-changer for businesses. Whether you're using AI for cost customer service, generating complex reports, or creating marketing content, this model adapts your needs. And as a bonus, NVIDIA has been upfront that while this model isn't designed for super specialized tasks like high-level math or legal reasoning, it's still versatile and powerful enough for most business applications. Just make sure to use NVIDIA's new model in the right context and you're good to go. However, the company has cautioned that the model has its limitations, particularly in specialized areas like law or advanced mathematics. So, while it's an incredibly versatile tool, businesses should still implement safeguards to avoid unintended mistakes. Now, let's switch gears and talk about Google. Recently, Google also made waves with their AI model Imagine 3, which just launched worldwide and get this, it's available for free. But hold up, there's a catch. Before we dive into that, let's break down what Imagine 3 is. Imagine 3 is Google's latest image generator and according to them, it's their best model yet for producing high-quality images. Google claims it's much better at following user instructions and generates fewer visual artifacts compared to previous versions. And honestly, based on early impressions, they're right. You can ask it to generate anything from photorealistic landscapes to oil paintings, even claymation-style scenes. But there's the downside. If you want to generate images of people, that feature comes 
comes with a price tag. To access it, you need to subscribe to Gemini Advance which costs $19.99 per month. So while you can create all the landscape, animals, and abstract art you want for free, generating human faces is behind a paywall. To put this into perspective, when you subscribe to Gemini Advance, it's not just the image generator you're getting. You also receive 2 terabytes of Google One storage and access to AI features in Google Docs, which is a pretty good deal if you're already invested in the Google ecosystem. Still, it's a bit disappointing that generating people images is, isn't available on the free tier. Let's break down the Imagine 3 works because it's a little different from the AI language generators. Unlike platforms that create multiple image variations for you to choose from, Imagine 3 gives you just one image per prompt. But the cool part is, you can refine that image by requesting changes and it remembers what you ask for. Every time you request a change, it generates a new image from scratch which is pretty neat. Plus, you can also download as many images as you want. There's no daily limit, even on the free tier. The resolution is 2048 by 2048 in JPEG format, which is quite high quality. Now, what really stands out with Imagine 3 is its text rendering capabilities. For example, if you're creating a comic book panel with a speech bubble, the text should be readable, which isn't always the case with AI image generators. But there's still room for improvement. We've seen some odd results, like a 1950s sci-fi comic panel where the text didn't come out quite right. Still, this is a step in the right direction, and Imagine 3 definitely deserves a spot among the top AI image generators. If you need to create a visual for your projects, this tool is worth exploring. Just remember you'll need to upgrade to generate images with human faces. Shifting back to NVIDIA for a moment, what is especially interesting about their new model isn't just its impressive benchmarks. NVIDIA is putting a strong emphasis on alignment, meaning how well the AI's outputs align with user needs and preferences. For businesses, this focus on alignment translates to fewer mistakes, more accurate responses, and better overall customer satisfaction. If a model can understand user intent better, companies will face fewer challenges trying to make it work for their operations. NVIDIA isn't stopping at text generation either. They've recently introduced the NVM 1.0 family of multi-model models capable of handling both text and images. Their flagship model, NVDM D72B, feature a staggering 72 2 billion parameters. This shows NVIDIA is not just competing, they are setting the pace. We're seeing a major shift in the AI landscape as NVIDIA steps into software development, challenging the dominance of companies like OpenAI and Entrophic. At the same time, Google is making tools like Imagine 3 accessible to everyday users. The AI arms race is heating up and over the next few months, everyone will be watching how these tools perform in real-world scenarios. NVIDIA's Lama 3.1 Neutron 70B Instruct is already making waves, but its success will hinge on how businesses implement it. Keep an eye on NVIDIA and Google. What's happening here is the future of AI unfolding right before us. Alright, that's it for today's video and if you find this video helpful, hit the like button and subscribe for more AI updates coming your way. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.